Todd Chrisley and his daughter Savannah appear to have arrived in the nick of time to save her former fiancé Nick Kerdiles after he was allegedly suicidal earlier this week. The 52-year-old Chrisley Knows Best star and his 24-year-old daughter called into 911 to get help from police on Monday in audio obtained by TMZ. Todd, whose recognizably accented voice is apparently heard on the tape, apparently tells the operator he believes Kurt Isles is suffering from a psychotic episode and is in the kitchen of a home in Nashville with a gun. He says on the tape that Carol's had the gun under his chin, though he says he had removed it by the time he called. A woman who is referred to as Savannah can be heard screaming in distress shortly after the start of the call, and Todd calls her over before telling the operator that her ex has the gun to his head. No. God. No. No. The frantic voice screams repeatedly in the distance. Look at what you're doing to her, shouts the voice that sounds like Todd. Then he says they might need a medic, as Savannah had allegedly broken a window to get to Kurt Isles and cut her hand in the process. We have the gun now, he adds. At the end of the audio the man who is allegedly Todd says that he threw the gun into the bushes, and he adds that Kurt Isles needs to go to a hospital for treatment. But on Wednesday evening, both Todd and Savannah appeared to confirm they made the call by appearing on an Instagram video jointly posted to both of their pages that featured Kerr Dials. They were antagonistic about the reporting and claimed that Savannah's ex had recently suffered a bout with COVID-19, and in the wake of that he had combined medication he was taking for the illness with alcohol, which they blamed on the alleged suicidal episode. Todd referenced his daughter and Kurt Isles' former relationship and said he didn't care if they were engaged or dating or just friends. Todd also claimed that Kurt Isles was taking a medication for baldness that could cause depression when paired with alcohol, which Kurt Isles didn't dispute. The trio seemed much more upbeat by the end of the video and were smiling and laughing while urging viewers to contact the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline. Savannah and Nick originally called off their engagement in September 2020 after three years, but she revealed to E! News in August 2021 that they had restarted their relationship, though their engagement was still off. If you are a person you know has suicidal thoughts, contact the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline at 1-800-273-TALK, 8255, text STRENGTH to the crisis text line at 741-741, or go to suicideprevectionlifeline.org.